Hello, this is Christine Glockler with the Glockler Group at Coldwell Banker Realty here to go over the April 2022 residential real estate market update for Lyle, Illinois. Now, the Lyle real estate market is still very much a strong seller's market. The monthly supply of inventory, meaning the time it would take to sell all of the current inventory for sale, is at two weeks. So to put things into perspective, anything under six months is considered a seller's market. Anything at six months is a neutral market, not necessarily a buyer's or a seller's market. And anything seven months and above is more indicative of a buyer's market. So Lyle is like a lot of the Chicago suburbs that we cover is very much a strong seller's market. Now let's go over median sales price and average sales price. So median sales price in March of 2022 was 345,000 compared to 269,750 in March of 2019. The average sales price in March 2022 was 355,312 compared to 292,568 in March 2019. Now, the homes for sale in March 2022, 23, compared to March of 2019, 116. So there is a shortage of inventory compared to what we normally have uh, this time of the year and a lot of buyer demand. So you can see that big difference between March of 2019 to March of 2022 as far as the number of homes for sale. Now, if you are thinking of selling, a lot of sellers are saying, you know, I see mortgage rates are going up or I, they're in contact with me and I notify them mortgage rates are going up and they actually went up quite a bit in a short amount of time already. And it's estimated, although no one has a crystal ball, that mortgage rates are going to increase quite a bit uh, the rest of this year. There are going to be various increases. So with that, as mortgage rates go up and housing prices go up, buyer affordability goes down. So some sellers are feeling, okay, if I've had thoughts of selling, I'm thinking of selling, could be advantageous to sell sooner rather than later because unfortunately there may be buyers that get priced out of the market or priced out of the price range because it's now so important that buyers who are taking out a mortgage have very, very current loan pre-approval letters. Not 30 days or 60 days, it really needs to be a pre-approval letter at the same date of writing a contract because mortgage rates are changing. Now, of course, generally speaking, mortgage rates are low. We've been in real estate for over 40 years and Judy, with whom I work, got into real estate when when interest rates were really high. So generally speaking, relatively, mortgage rates are still lower. It's like the saying goes, you buy real estate and wait, you don't wait to buy real estate. It has to work for you and your short-term and long-term goals, right? So the number of homes sold in March of 2022 was 37 compared to 34 in March of 2019. Now, if you are thinking of buying, selling, investing in Lyle, the surrounding area, the Chicago suburbs, contact me. I'd be glad to have a conversation with you. Real estate is very local. It also depends on property type and price range. So usually as the price goes higher, there's usually a smaller buyer pool, but with there being such a difference between inventory and the amount of buyers out looking, properties are still moving for the most part in a short amount of time compared to what they were when I first officially started working in real estate full time. The market was very different. And so the market is doing the real estate market is doing great things right now, and like I said, no one can predict the future, but some people feel you know prices are going to continue to go up, and as properties sell in multiple offer situations and prices go up, then that becomes the most recent comp for then a property that is comparable that gets listed in that community or in that local area. 
So I could go over all of that with you. This is Lyle in general. So I hope you found this helpful. Thank you and have a great day.